Hello, I'm Lena Wynn, and here's your CBS On The Go update. We begin with your CBS2 travel forecast. Here's your meteorologist, Craig Herrera. All right, Lena, got a couple of systems moving into the Pacific Northwest. Meantime, high pressure ahead of that's going to keep the Intermountain West, the Desert Southwest, well above average. Weak system moves across into Minneapolis, but most of that rain and snow is going to move up into Canada. A couple series of storms, though, will continue to move into the Pacific Northwest. One to two inches of rain for Portland, Seattle, and snow up to one foot for the Cascades, right up into Montana as well. And that area of high pressure starts to move over Texas. Rather quiet for the rest of the lower 48. That's through Sunday, though. The tail end of that system will bring some cooler conditions to Southern California as well. After that, things start to warm up as we go into next week. Travel wise for Burbank, lots of sunshine, 76, a beautiful start to the weekend. Temperatures will drop about 5 to 10 degrees on Sunday, though. Las Vegas over to 69 degrees, 62 in San Francisco, right downtown, 82 in Palm Springs, San Diego at 69 in Lena. Uh, Los Angeles will be in the lower 70s. Very nice, Craig. Thank you. The first official commitment for the newest royal couple drew crowds today. Prince Harry and his fiance Meghan Markle were in Nottingham to support AIDS awareness. Terry Okita shows us the welcome they received. Prince Harry's fiance Meghan Markle stole the show at the couple's first royal meet and greet. Hundreds lined up early in the English city of Nottingham to get a glimpse of the American who won the British prince's heart. Yeah. Megan, she looks beautiful, doesn't she? We're so happy for them both. We are. Well wishers waved British and US flags to welcome the newly engaged couple. It's lovely. <laughs> it's fantastic. Prince Harry and Markle visited a charity fair to mark World AIDS Day, a cause close to the heart of Harry's late mother, Princess Diana. They're just delightful. Um, I'm obviously very starstruck, but they're incredibly approachable, very human. In cities across the UK, excitement is building for Harry and Meghan's royal wedding, especially here in Windsor. The couple will marry at the castle next May. Mike and Melanie Manch are visiting from Pittsburgh and are happy to hear Harry is marrying an American. He must really really, really love her to kind of circumvent tradition. I just think it's adorable. Everybody loves a romance story. The couple says the first thing they connected on was their passion for humanitarian work. It's one of the yeah. first things we started talking about when we met was just the different things that we wanted to do in the world. Can you show us some skills? They stopped by a school Friday to support a program that steers young people away from violence. Prince Harry and Markle say they feel strongly about change and look forward to creating it together. Terry Okita, CBS News, Windsor. And now here's your CBS on the go sports. In a stunning move, football coach Jimbo Fisher left his job at Florida State University today to take the head coaching job at Texas A&M. According to reports, Fisher will be the highest paid coach in college football history. Fisher will reportedly receive a 10 year, $75 million contract. Fisher led Florida State to the national title during his tenure and uh, even won the Orange Bowl just at last year. But after a disappointing season this year, there were rumblings that Fisher should be fired, which, according to those close to Fisher, did not sit well with the coach. Immediately following CBS 2 News at 11 tonight, watch The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. Guests include the legendary Carol Burnett and Louis Black. And right after Colbert, watch The Late Late Show with James Corden. His guests include actress Kristen Bell. Watch Corden and Colbert right after CBS 2 News at 11. And that's your CBS On The Go update. Remember, we're always on at CBSLA.com. And join us every night for CBS 2 News at 5, 6, and 11.